So, um, what's going on, you guys? It's, you know, Vanny. And today, I was kind of wanted to just go over what I've been doing. So, I think mostly this year, I've been mostly a little bit more busy. That's hence why you see these gap-long videos of, like, a month in between. Because I was just busy. Like, because at this time, I had, um, I had, like, school to deal with. I had work. I had this relationship. Now, I'm no longer in, thank God. I think... I think what really rated me down the most um, this year was probably just the amount of time I've been busy. I haven't really, really been, um, you know, been able to make videos. I've been playing, like, my games here and there, and this is why I appreciate my Switch a little bit more, because I get to play any game I want on the go. And, like, even though it's not the best console in the world, it's still a really, really good, still a really, really good console. Um, just for, like, you know, playing for 10 minutes and then you can get off and get back to work. I really, I really do appreciate that. Um, the relationship, it was kind of on and off for, like, around three years. I didn't, I don't, I didn't want to talk about that. So, I won't get into too much detail. But, basically, I got so busy that the relationship could no longer work. It could, it could no longer work in... I kind of felt like later on I was readily available to be there for for my um, partner back then. But yeah, um, I think the third thing was just work. I think work has really, really been like an eight-hour slog. I've been kind of transitioning out of work because you know, because you know I still have a stable amount of money to just live on my own. I have, yeah, I have a stable amount of money to live on my own, so I'll be fine with that. So, with all, all the doom and gloom out the way, let's talk about the yearly recap of 2023. Three months late, I'm sorry. But this is probably won't happen again, though. Unless I get, like, really, really busy. I do need to get better with communication. I think that's the one thing. I'm, but, then, but um, anyway, 2023 has been a very, very wild year for me. As a content creator and a person in general, some of these videos are just unlisted. <laughs> uh, these are just clips of this random stuff, random shit, um, on my PlayStation. But um, 2023 is be kind of wild. So let's start kind of backwards. I won't stay here too long because I see um, as I've been studying the analytics, most of the people like the shorter end videos rather than like you know. The longer end videos, and it's kind of um, it's kind of nice to see that I don't have to spend so much time just to make um, you know, those kind of videos. Oh yeah, <laughs> I forgot about this. This didn't upload because my PlayStation was terrible. But yeah, uh, we'll get to that video really later. But let's start from January of 2023. Yeah, this is the first video made of the year. This one did really, really decently. This is one I used to play Overwatch. Overwatch was a game I wanted to move off from because, you know, Overwatch was kind of... Yeah, I think at the time, Overwatch was my main goal with this channel, to be an Overwatch competitive person. But I feel like there was so many people playing Overwatch that it kind of just wasn't very good. Like, they, this video popped off, but so little videos popped off from Overwatch that I didn't really care for it. Also, the company itself is kind of shit. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, yeah, sexual harassment company is kind of shit. So, yeah, about that. This was a test video of, um, Wild Hearts. This was a brand of bug video I found. This was a pretty good video. I need to update this low-key. Because my opinions have fairly changed. Um, this is Hunter Arms, Wild Hearts. I thought it was going to be a Wild Hearts content creator at the time. Ugh, man, I hate it. I didn't hate Wild Hearts. Yeah, but Wild Hearts was a game that I was guessing up low-key. I didn't think it would be better than Monster Hunter, but yeah, I thought it was a pretty fun, engaging game until they stopped supporting it. Uh, this was a random diamond game. What the person was actively throwing? I think it was a diamond game. I don't. I'm not sure. This was doing placements. I think. 
And this is before, like, you know, you saw the rank of everybody in the lobby. Uh, this is the Pachi Mario event. Didn't really go that well. This was just controller gameplay. Really quick coolers. This is unlisted, I think. I might post more Dokkan content. I've been playing that a lot more recently. Uh, this was this. Overwatch TV after pool lines. Yeah, this is pretty much just me riding the dick off of, um, April Fools. How to beat Fatality. This is the April Fools video officially. Uh, this is Life Weaver. Uh, this is Life Weaver again. So yeah, I, mean, I was going pretty steady on the Overwatch content. It didn't, like, this was an old quick play video. This pub stomping. Uh, this was Brig. And this is when I kill the. This is when I kill the Genji with Mercy. I remember this. This is kind of insane. Oops. It still is like that to this day because they increase the health of every hero. And Mercy's pistol does more fucking damage than Genji. And it's kind of insane. <laughs> Even the person was like, bro. <laughs> like, two of the, like, the shittest heroes in the... Shittest, um... Like, one of the, like, shittest heroes in the game heal getting healed by a fucking Mercy. And then, like, just the fact that... This dude is... This is gold right here. The second part right here is when we all went up to the top. This is Genji again, right here. Mm -hmm. This is when we all went up to the top. They grabbed us. Yeah, I think they grabbed almost all of them, even. Gets pulled back. Rolls out. And then they get grabbed. I keep healing. I don't have my ultimate. And then they use tree. And this person fucking dies. And then he leaves the game. That shit was insane. Like, that was, that's how I know Overwatch was getting kind of, like, into a bad state. It went a Genji Blade. It was supposed to be a most powerful, no, one of the more powerful, um, ultimates in the game. Getting shit on. <laughs> but, yeah. Um, I did try to start transitioning towards Borderlands content. Most of my live streams were Borderlands content. Uh, this one popped off unexpectedly. I was like, holy shit. Like, it's just me just killing Wilhelm with fucking, um, Cloud Kill. Cloud, if you don't know Borderlands 2, Cloud Kill was pretty much fucking busted. And, like, this got 17,000 views. And I was like, holy fuck, dude. Like, it was crazy how... That was more, more, probably one of the, that pushed me over to the, um, the 65,000, the, the 100,000 view mark. And that was really, really good. Like, that was really, really inspiring at the time. So I just kept pumping out videos every day. So, like, I just kept pumping and pumping. Like, that really inspired me to do more. And then, um, this was a Guidance Lance thing. I didn't think, I think the longer videos usually don't do that well. Because, you know, the attention span of just humankind hasn't really been that good. So I think around 15 minutes is around my mark for videos nowadays. Which I'll discuss later on the future of the channel after we're done with this. Because as you can see here, most of the videos, um, this one was forever ago. Um, I already I, I love uploaded that though. But mostly, as you can see here, most of my shorter videos, um, you know, they do a lot better than the longer ones. Because it kind of just feels relieving that I don't have to make hour long videos <clears throat> just to get a couple of clicks. But that's cool. Uh, this was when I started transitioning a little bit more into Monster Hunter. But I think around this time, Monster Hunter was my... I just kind of burnt myself out on Monster Hunter, though, to be honest with you. Like, I, I did um put enough skill into the game to make myself like that. But I think, like, a couple years back, I think... Uh, where is that one video? Because I remember it. It had a shit ton of views. Uh, I don't think it's from this year. This one. 
This one has 87,000 views. And this shit was insane. It was just me falling off a fucking cliff. Like, I've never... I've rarely never seen a video like this. Yeah, that's just me falling off a damn cliff from two years ago. This is probably, like, one of my iconic videos of all time. Just me falling off a fucking cliff with Clutch Claw. And then it somehow happened again with the same fucking monster. So... Yeah. <laughs> Thanks a lot for the, the support on that video. But... Uh... Yeah, let's get back into the main subject. Like, I was so excited when I broke broke past the 100,000 view mark. Yeah, when I broke past the 100,000 view mark, it was so insane at the time. Like, I was just popping. I was, like, excited. I told, like, my mom and everything. Like, like I was just genuinely proud of myself because of that shit, too. And then, yeah, you can see here, it kind of went on a Monster Hunter spree. This video is very, very successful. I will probably never quit uh, Monster Hunter. But this is when, yeah, that happened. And you know, when the Glavinus died from that damn um, Clutch Claw attack. Uh, this is... This is Awakening with Switch X. Uh, this was a story mission. This was Monster Hunter Now. I don't play that game that much anymore. I still walk out, but yeah. This one's kind of stupid, I'm, to be honest. You have people as like, anyone is welcome, and yet you get kicked. Uh, this one's pretty basic. Captured this. This one was pretty this much. Just 20 minutes of the Azor Rathlo sleeping. This was a fail. This is when, like, the first time you used to, like, consistently hunt Fatalis, though. I feel like I did get a lot better. It didn't... Yeah, this was unlisted. Most of these are unlisted. Uh, this was a while long. I, probably probably my biggest mistake of 2023 was making videos were, like, super fucking huge. Making them super big and stuff. And then, like... It kind of just burnt me out mentally. And then, like... I didn't mind playing the game for an hour, like, at all, but I feel like minimum to, in today's age, people don't want to see, um, videos that are over an hour long of you talking about absolutely fucking nothing, unless it's, like, a competitive vid, a competitive VOD review or something like that, where you break down something, but, yeah, this was a long story, because I saw most of my clips getting, like, so much, so much traction. It was kind of, like, erratic. My growth spurt was kind of erratic, sort of. And then, around this time, I started making shorts. Shorts were really successful as well. This is Borderlands 3. I started kind of dying off after I stopped posting Borderlands content. I don't really make shorts now, but I do feel like I do need to make more shorts. In 2024, I kind of just stopped posting stuff. 2023, I was kind of slowing down on the content farm. Like, I was posting a, like a seven-day gap in between these two. Posted two videos in one day. Uh, yeah, these did, these did do a lot of videos. I did do a lot of videos in 2023, though. But, the future is now. So, we're in 2024, and only two videos has come out. My bad about that. As I explained earlier, I just got busy. I really got demotivated after the... That post I made about the clips I found on my computer, of all things. Because two years ago, my computer was fried. Like, the fans weren't working. I got a new one. I got a, a kind of new one now. So, yeah. The future of my content. So, as usual, I want to make my, um... I want to make myself more variety stream... Variety based, of course. I do think, like, going toward tackling different types of games, of course are, um, pretty good. Soon I'm getting a Nintendo Switch, um, capture card, of course, so I can finally start streaming Splatoon, because Splatoon is a really fun game. It's, I've been kind of binging it out, because I've been busy. Uh, Monster Hunter content will, will be in pause for right now. I just, because I've just been burnt out from the game, because I used to always play Generations Ultimate on my Switch. I, I'm just burnt out from the series in general. 
uh, I'll try to communicate more with the post and post more shorts. Uh, Dokkan, I do want to kind of upload more Dokkan content this year too. Um, if you don't know what Dokkan is, it's a mobile game that was, that came out 2015. I've been playing it for seven years. It's a really good game. You should try it out. Um, and just in general, some quality of life changes. And as you can see here, I've been starting to do a little bit more editing and stuff for clips. And stuff like these two videos were, these three videos, I'm sorry. These four videos have, um, have editing in it. And it kind of gained a lot of traction. So I do feel like I need to put a little bit more time editing. Because when I made this post, I really, really got demotivated. Because, like, it was just terrible just to see that on the channel. Like, like yeah. It kind of see, like, all that hard work I did was basically this for shitty, shitty YouTube's um, thing to go down. But, yeah. I think later today I'll be recording a video. I might be recording it on my phone, or I might be doing some other other game on my computer. But look forward to that. If if not, it might come out in it might come out in a couple hours or so. But yeah, I do want to work on more videos. And yeah. And last thing to note. These, this video right here did really well. Thanks for, you know, supporting this video, of course. I, I didn't expect this video to pop off. It was just us playing Sparking Zero or <laughs> Dragon Ball Nexus. It's a pretty fun game, though. I actually look, really like this game, to be honest with you. But, yeah. I hope to see y'all later. And, you know, stay frosty.